figured it out. Literally, luckily, and unluckily, five seconds after, there's like a... On the wall, there's a stick of dynamite you gotta light. It's really hard to see. That's all you gotta... Gotta do. What the fuck is growling at me? Should just go back now. Ooh. Yeah, sorry for that no progress video, but I hope you guys enjoy this with me. Small station was one. Right. I won't be going further with you. Big surprise. Still needed here. The tunnels have collapsed. If you still want to get to Polis, you'll have to take a detour. You can get to the armory from here, and afterwards right. you will have to go through the stations belonging to the Reds and the Nazis. Let's move. As you can see, I need to charge, but I kind of feel like a, a load screen's coming. Eh, fuck it, I'll load. I'll do it anyways, because I don't... At the smithy, look for an acquaintance of mine. Andrew the blacksmith. Mention my name. He'll give you a hand. Andrew the blacksmith. Okay. You guys fucking hallucinate a lot. And you're all just like, eh, normal day. This is for all the fallen. Yep. Even in these times, we can't relinquish the things that make us human. Right. What the fuck, dude? What are you doing? Get out of me. <laughs> what are we doing? Is that so no one knew where to go? I wonder if that, that was supposed to trick people. Oh yeah, that looks fun. Thanks, dick. Let's That's go. It. Get in. Later. Remember, everything depends on you and you alone. No pressure. Until we meet again. Goodbye, Arthur. <sighs> station was where most of the weapons in the metro were made. There had been an arms factory located above, and after the nukes fell, many of the workers settled here. I was looking for Andrew the Smith, but he found me first. Story just kind of spoiled the story. He found me first. Heads up. Eh, eh. Hit it down. Stop staring at it. Don't fucking stare at it. I don't stay near these mushroom things. What's this? Okay. Let's go. What the hell are we doing? What the fuck? This game is f way bigger than I thought it'd be. I'm gonna have to look these guys up, what they did before. Who? Oh. Who goes there? Stand still! Okay. Hey, loosen up. It's a human. Kill the light already. Well, you look human. <laughs> That's all that counts. Come in. This is a free station. <laughs> I will slap you with me cock. Bitch. I'm not Russian. I can't do a Russian accent. <laughs> Obviously. Uh, what are we doing? Uh, Careful, kid. Our free station is under the watchful eye of the Reds. Paranoia is the new game in town, so keep yourself below the radar. You understand? The Reds, the Nazis? Probably. Probably and yes. This is where Attention. I stopped. Attention. The Nazis Attention. kicked my ass. Is currently being carried out at the armory. Please stay at your 
registered residences and assist the law enforcement personnel in their work. Be vigilant, comrades. The enemy never sleeps. Wait, those animals never fucking sleep? That sucks. It's not where to go, is it? Go to hell. Go to hell. Okay. It's not where to go. I hope. Face to the wall. This is an inspection. Hey, come on. Quit harassing me. I don't swing that way. <laughs> Got the bolt yet? Prepare for inspection. Oh, I'm always prepared for. Hush. And who are you? The comedian's boyfriend. Put your hands out. You're under arrest. All right, all right. Lay off. Ugh. I'll come quietly. Boom, son. Run! Stop our shields, Win! I'm gonna kill her. Go! Let's get them! Come on, follow me! Go, go! I'm trying to run, it won't let me. This is the fastest it's letting me go. Oh shit. That is awesome. Oh dude. Where am I supposed to go? Alright. Hey, yes, in case you're wondering, those bullets will shred and kill you. Obviously. But it looks like it's just a stage scene, but no, they will shred you up. I'm always prepared for this. Uh, doctor, could you check my prostate while you're at it? I'm pissing kind of funny. It's glowing. It must be the radiation. It's glowing. You... Hush. And who are you? Right, try to the pay attention. Boyfriend. <laughs> Put your hands out. The comedian's boyfriend. Yes. Shut up. All right, all right. Lay off. Ugh. I'll come quietly. Are these the Nazis? Run. Or is he a Nazi? I'm gonna kill her. Go! Let's get them! Come on, follow me! Be careful, idiots! Get down! Get to the chopper! Oh fuck, go dude! Go! I don't wanna lose him this time! I see him, I see him! Okay, he died. That's why I, I can't follow him anymore. Well, shit. There. Stop your punk. Oh, sweet. I don't have to do anything. If right, there's cool. still a god left in our world, that day he was with me. I had been rescued by Han's friend, Andrew the Blacksmith. He would I thought he was going to say Andrew Ryan. Station. But the only way goes through a goddamn battlefield, the front line between the Reich and the Reds. Are you pretending you're in that field? Take these overalls, put them over your clothes. I swear to God, he's rounding up the volunteers. Yeah, he's pretending Nazi he's in Russian that field. Patients. They're about to send a train full of new recruits straight into the fire. But you will be riding the train unannounced. Your seat won't be first class, but you don't have to pay the fare with your own blood either. <laughs> Once the troop train has passed the roadblocks, you're on your own. There are many in the metro who hate the Reds because they're afraid of them. The Reds always go hungry even though they work around the clock. They're told to toil for they're told they toil for a better future, but year after year their lives get even more miserable. They fight with abandon as if not afraid of death at all, and their commanders just throw them away, piling up their bodies to block enemy gun encampments. That's why it's so fucking hard. Spending their lives as if their charges were immortal. But they are mortal and they die. Of exhaustion, of overworking, of bullets fired by their enemies and their own commissars to shoot those retreating. They are told, damn, they are superior, they are made of steel, not flesh. And that is why I pity them. 
What do they live for? The idols of the past are long gone, but they are kept in the dark about it. The slogans they communicate with are meaningless in the new world. They are prohibited from speaking or even thinking freely. Anyone asking questions is deemed a traitor. Anyone who says life's better outside the red line is a spy and a saboteur. You have to hide everything human about you and become just like the rest of them. But there are also people like Andrew the Blacksmith here, people who refuse to abandon hope and who persevere. If I were in his shoes, I'd be long gone. Why is he still here? Why is, he af is he afraid of being shot making his escape? Looks like he's building something to me. Oh. Alright, we're going to end this here. It's a good bit of videos. Start working on some other projects for a little bit. Just trying to tear this one up so we can knock it out quick since it seems like it's the least liked. Should probably just get it out of the way. I, I started it and I want to finish it. Alright, thank you guys so much. Peace out.